Thank you. 
Hello everyone! How is everyone doing today? Great to see everyone! Happy Tuesday Eve! Happy Tuesday Eve. I oh, hope I uh, brought a smile to your face there, uh, Miko. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna play that. I'm gonna play that sound effect. We don't play sound effects in here, but I, I will play a sound effect for Miko. I will play that sound effect for Miko. Definitely. Hope everyone is doing well today and stuff. The start of another week. The start of another game. <laughs> We're just like flying through all of these uh, these playthroughs and stuff here. I mean, you can. It took us all stream on Friday, well, minus Nintendo Power Hour, and we made it all the way through and did like. Well, I, I can we call it a hundred percent playthrough? I mean, there's hundred percent playthrough like grabbing every coin. I don't know. We played every level, every level in every world. We didn't skip any of them. So I mean, whatever you call that, we did that. So, um, of Super Mario 3, so we'll be doing the same thing with Super Mario World, and we'll be, uh, trying that and stuff, uh, there as well, uh, as well, too, so, uh, it should be, uh, be super, super exciting, um, not really any other big giveaways or anything else kind of coming up here, we already, uh, got our Friday streams, um, and stuff already taken care of and stuff for the uh, for the week, hopefully be able to get, uh, Yoda's game, the Super Mario Brothers 2 copy, um, out and stuff like that probably sometime either this week or probably next week. Um, but, um, anyway, just a ton of fun. We're gonna be wrapping up this year and stuff with just playing a lot of, uh, some retro games and stuff here. But remember, our first stream in January is going to be playing, uh, Pokemon Yellow. So that's gonna be the exciting, uh, exciting part as well, too. So, definitely, definitely awesome. And, uh, before we get started, huge thank you to Dow Cow and Taragna for those, uh, fantastic hosts as well, too. Ow! In Spider Monkey with the resub three months. That means we're gonna be spinning the wheel at the end of, uh, stream today. And thank you so much there, Spider Monkey, and stuff for that, uh, for that resub. Three months total. My gosh, getting uh, getting up there. I, I enjoy that uh, that new little uh, uh, badge as well too. Now you've uh, you've upgraded from a Nintendo controller to a Super Nintendo controller, which is perfect because we're starting Super Mario World, which is a Super Nintendo game, right? But thank you so much, there, Spider Monkey, for that uh, stuff, man. That the Super Nintendo controller looks amazing right there. If I can get a shout out and stuff too for Spider Monkey eighty three, really awesome streamer. Oh my gosh, he is he is an awesome fellow captain as well too. I just I, I swear I just want to like go out for a drink with him and stuff like that and everything else like that. Could you imagine two captains, two people? We should wear our captain hats and stuff and go out for go for, go go out for some grog. That would be hilarious, wouldn't it? That would be that would be super cool. That would be super cool. But um, anyway, and stuff. Super awesome streamer. Really, a really good friend of mine, and stuff like that too. Big supporter of the uh, of the the stream and the community and everything else too. It would be just super, super cool as well. Um, where, where, where are you? And so, where, where are you located? And so, are you, are you in California? There, Spider Monkey. Are we in the same time zone? Um, and stuff too. I, I keep forgetting to ask you, and stuff too. So you're in California. Okay. Are you in Southern or Northern California? And stuff because I'm in Southern California. I wonder would that be so funny? And I always like think of that same thing. I mean, California is just such a huge state, right? But it's just like, could you imagine like you know you're both like streamers and stuff. You're both supporting each other and like you live like down the block, <laughs> you know, like a city over. I mean, you don't have to tell me exact. I just Northern California, Southern California, and stuff. LA area. I mean that that's cool. That's cool with me. I mean, believe me, I'm not not trying to. Uh, Trying to get, get anybody's um, address or something like that around here on stream. And G-Man, thank you so much for that uh, that host, sir, buddy. It's so awesome to see Southern Cal. Okay, cool. Same as same as me. Oh my gosh, that that is so funny. We could be like super close. I mean, you can if it wasn't COVID times, we could probably go out for a beer or a grog or whatever. And thank you there, Miko, for doing that uh, shout out as well too. Let me catch up with chat and stuff here too. 
with uh, everything else and stuff. Versace, oh my gosh, Versace trolling me and stuff like that with the uh, the, the death counter and stuff here. Oh man, and Dow Cow and Ragna, thank you so much for those hosts. And uh, Ragna, thank you so much for taking care of the shoutouts there as well too. And have a great lurk there, buddy. Oh man, and how are you doing and stuff there, Dow Cow? Jazavar, awesome to see you there, Jazavar. Save the captain, drum six, captain 174 times. Oh my gosh, and Miko! How are you doing? It's so funny, my wife and stuff like that goes beep beep and stuff like that. And I always tell her when she goes beep beep, I'm like, you're a sheep. So now she starts saying that. So it's just, it's just funny. It has like been one of those things and stuff kind of going around the family and stuff there too. And MTG, thank you so much for that uh, host as well too there, buddy. And I had to play that sound effect there for you, Miko. Every single time I see Miko and now, of course, the, uh, the, the derpy, uh, the, the, the derpy cheese and stuff like that. Oh my gosh. My, the, the potato buddy. And D-Man, how's it going there, D-Man? Awesome to see you there, D-Man. My buddy. Well, you know who the favorite is in the crew. <laughs> Everybody's trying to say that everybody's like the favorite. Everybody's like, oh, MTG's the favorite. Oh, Ragnar's the favorite. Oh, Miko's the favorite. Why can't I just do something nice and stuff every now and then for uh, for for one mod and stuff every now and then? It is going great and stuff there, Spider Monkey. So awesome to see you there, buddy. And thank you so much for that uh, for that resub, everybody. The derpy cheese. Exactly. Got you did get some pyramids in. He's he's okay. <laughs> And thank you again there, Miko, and stuff for doing that, uh, that shout-out. That would be awesome. It definitely would be awesome. Southern California, oh my gosh. Yeah, definitely watch. We're, we're like neighbors. That's so hilarious and stuff, too. And Miko, thank you so much for doing that shout-out and stuff there. For G-Man and MTG, thank you so much for taking care of that, uh, that shout-out and stuff. Uh, and for that host there, buddy. Weasel Almighty, how's it going there, Weasel? Awesome to see ya. Appreciate it. You are welcome there, Miko. You are welcome. You know what? If they're gonna flag me for one little potato sound effect and stuff there in the stream, oh my gosh, come after me. Big delays tonight, so mostly, uh, mostly lurking. Aww. I'm sorry to hear that there, MTG. Yeah, see, exactly. I know, the MTG and stuff on. Oh, there's, there goes our favorite mod. Now he's a ghost mod. <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay, alright, we are caught up with chat, not really too much to announce, just uh, playing some Super Mario World and stuff here. And... Alright, let's see what we got. Welcome, this is Dinosaur Land. In this strange land, we find that Princess Toadstool is missing again. Looks like Bowser is at it again. Man. Yoshi's Island 1. Reach 500. Oh my gosh, you did reach 500 hours. Congrats there, uh, there, G-Man. You, you ranked up now, too. I, you know what? That's one of those things. I'm, I'm hoping sometime in the next couple weeks to really get that, uh, that Wall of Fame updated. Wall of Fame, sub wall, all, all of the above as well. I just, like, the last time we upgraded, updated the, uh, the Wall of Fame was um august oh my gosh and so much has changed since then so many uh so many hours they automatically assume it's bowser could be some i know right exactly why do they why do they gotta why do they gotta do that to uh to bowser there right exactly which is how mario works i guess <laughs> again peach could actually be having a thing <laughs> and mario hasn't accepted it yet maybe i mean it could be it could be Played this uh, a few months ago with my brother. Twist was whenever one of us died, we would have to eat a zombie. <laughs> oh my gosh, <laughs> that is too funny. I would totally have done that. I totally done that. I, I'm back to the diet as of today. So, way way too many uh, cheats and stuff this weekend. I got my uh, Mexican food fix last night. So that was uh, that was really good. Had a uh, two ta taco plate. Stuff, uh, last night got some chips and salsa but now I'm gonna try to be good for uh, for a week and a half until Christmas so but yeah this is my second favorite Mario game I love Super Mario 3 but man I just it was so funny Jazzavar is like oh my gosh Super Mario Bros. 3 level 7 sucks and I'm, I think so I think level 7 is really bad 6 is really 
bad. And then we played it. And I'm like, oh my gosh, level 7 can kiss my ass. Level 7. Um, but, uh, but anyway, yeah, I mean, it's just like level... That, uh, that level 7, oh my gosh, we had so many de We probably had like, what, 20 or 25 deaths just on level 7, world 7? It felt like world 8 we flew through. Yep, should uh, do what I did when I streamed Dark Souls. Get a mixture of Sunny D and Cheap Vodka and take a drink every time you die. See, I might be able to do that. I might be able to do that. Stuff there. The Sunny D and stuff wouldn't be very diet friendly, but... You can do that with, like, a vodka. But yeah, we had so many deaths. It was just... It was ridiculous on the amount of deaths that we had. Then again, too, I mean, we were like, what, what were we? We were like on our third beer, I think. Second or third beer and stuff that night. Maybe it was just those two beers. It was those spicy beers. We were on our second spicy beer. I didn't have, no, I think it was. Yeah. It was just those two two spicy beers, but I, I like started drinking on an empty stomach too. Soft is giving away free stuff for their games until December nineteenth. Be able to claim them even if you don't have the game they are for. Really? That's cool. Yeah, you know, what uh, what games definitely. Look at that. Ten lives already. Lives all. This this is such a great game. I mean this is really a close second. Of my favorite uh, Mario game. Oh, and look who we get! Gonna be over here! Today is Assassin's Creed Valhalla, but it's a Mr. Each. Oh, cool! DLC oh, DLC for the game. Ah! Ray, thank you for rescuing me. My name is Yoshi. On my way to rescue my friends, Bowser trapped me in that egg. That is excellent. All right. So how has everybody's week been going so far? Like today and so by like really about uh, another uh, week and a half of work really for me and stuff. Next week Wednesday and then off for a week and a half there. So. Uh, looking, uh, looking forward to some, uh, some downtime. So, hi, my, I was gonna rescue my, my kid. I, my, yeah, and he just hit me in the back of the head. That really hurt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was just so funny. Just trying to get quoted again. Week's going uh, okay so far. That is good to hear. <laughs> is it just me or it just seems like in this game here that like one-ups are just all over the place. And again, too, I felt that same way in Super Mario Bros. 3. Um, but then again, too, we almost used up all of our lives towards the end of it. It's a good thing that we got all those extra lives through there, but we were going through lives like crazy in World 7. Drinking in World 7 does not mix very well. play Yoshi Safari Super Scope 6 game. Yoshi looks at you if you shoot him in the back of the head. Oh, really? Huh. Hilarious. Right. 
So what is everybody's favorite Mario game? Favorites. Very, very close first and second is uh, Mario 3 and then Super Mario World. Funny because we're actually, like, when, when you put, like, um, you know, Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door, I almost, I might have to, like, change my list up. Thousand Year Door was so much fun. It was so funny and stuff, too. There was some, like, really great humorous parts and stuff in that game. So, I might, I, I, I might have to change. That's a hard one. I know, right? I just, I don't know. I'm not, not really a huge fan, I guess, of the new ones. I guess I just don't play them as much. Like, I just like going back to the ones that I just grew up playing. So... Super Mario World, Mario Bros. 3, Super Mario Bros. 1. See, I would pick Super Mario Bros. 2 over 1. Step 2. I love them all. Actually, uh, Mario 6 or Mario Odyssey, but the new Super uh, ones are great on the DS and 3DS. Didn't play all of the ones for the Wii. So, gotcha. Yes, I got it. I really got to play those. So, I. I haven't really played too much and got too much too into them. Super Mario Brothers for the NES, I mean, that's the most iconic, I'd say. Gotcha. The NES ones, but lacking a safe feature hurts him. Innovative as they were. Yeah, well, that that's why I think when they uh, when they uh, came up with Super Mario All-Stars, it was kind of the best of, uh, of uh, both worlds there. Really, because then it did kind of add that uh, safe feature where you were able to... Um, you know, you were, you were able to, um, you know, at least restart that world, you know? Zelda had a safe feature back in the day. That's one reason why I think between Mario and Zelda franchise, I would pick uh, Zelda. So, Zelda was a different genre. It kind of needed a safe feature. I mean, that's true, too. Played the NES ones long. Gotcha. Hey, Yellow T-Rex! How are you doing there, Yellow T-Rex? How are you doing there, my friend? <laughs> Game could top Zelda too, as far as I'm concerned. Really? I yeah, I know. I really, I really love Zelda. The very first three Zelda games. I mean, really, if if I streamed, if I would say that I streamed like five to seven days a week, I would, I would for sure be going through. Um, the first three Zelda games, probably every six months. <laughs> Easily every year. And we're, hey, Ragna, how's it going there, buddy? Awesome to see you there, my friend. Almost 1,200 hours in Fancy Hardline 2 and still not as good. Oh my gosh. That's a lot of time. A lot of time. I'm really kind of curious to see how far we're going to get tonight. 740 of them are put into my main character, Scarlet Trinity. Nice! Skyrim should be on Game Pass starting tomorrow. Oh, really? Nice! That is awesome. It's really great when you have, like, iconic games like that and stuff, you know, coming out and stuff like that. Makes it really exciting. Seems like one ups are like a plenty in this game. One has played Skyrim yet? Oh gosh. Yeah. I think that we should go over. Ow! It make me eat that. It sharp and tastes like ow! <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, look at that. Already the bonus round.
Oh, there's one. I was about to die. Catch you all later. All right, there, Miko. Have a fantastic evening. In 1200 hours. Great mod for Skyrim that adds a world based on Mario. Very high quality mod. It's on Xbox One as well, not PS4 because they don't allow custom assets. So what's everybody's thoughts? How far do you think we are going to get um, today? I'm among the, the lower numbers among my alliance in terms of hours played. Oh my gosh. He's there, Jazzavar. I can. Vanilla Dome? I would I would think so. Oh well, we got a one up from that. You didn't go and cap I'd say the last world. <laughs> oh my gosh. Jeez, I really didn't think that we were gonna beat Super Mario 3 all in one um all in one go. I really I really did not expect that. We just kept going and I'm like Proper gentlemen, respect, you all respect their wishes on the first playthrough. And while b -sing go all the way. Oh gosh. <laughs> yeah, but what would you constitute as like a 100% um, playthrough though? Do you have to get like every coin in every level or do you just beat like every single level? Because that's technically what we did, was we, like every level. Didn't skip any of them. <laughs> if you're on the opposite side of the fence. Yeah, I ex yeah, no, I knew that. I was trying to just, uh, the, the one-ups and stuff there. Hey, Recon! How's it going there, Recon? Awesome to see you there, buddy. Can't really knock it on those on the on the fence. <laughs> like so, ah, <laughs> that's so funny. Good new cap. I am doing great there. All right, got it. First world down. Hundred percent completionist in Mario games. I'd say you need every coin, gold coin in the later games. So three, first stage, every stage secrets exist. Every single regular yellow coin, yeah. Going for both child and animal cruelty. <laughs> yeah, all at all at once, Mario was defeated the demented Iggy Koopa in um, Castle Number One and rescued. Yoshi's friend, who is still trapped in an egg. Together, they now travel to Donut Land. <laughs> Eat all bosses complete. Every stage is opposing to uh, warping and skipping. Yeah. Yeah, and that's kind of that's what we did. Yeah, I didn't want to every single coin and all like all of that stuff. You know, I didn't want to warp. I mean, literally, you could beat Super Mario. Brothers 3, like, super quick when you're... I get two of the whistles and stuff like that, you could be at the end. And, and it's like <laughs> exotic dinosaur <laughs> finally snapped. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, that's what they didn't tell you. Yeah, it's weird. It's supposed to do random quotes. 
It's supposed to do random quotes, but it always does the same one. I'm gonna start turning it off. I turned it back on. I turned it on and stuff like that, and I'm like, that would be cool to do random quotes, but it hasn't been doing random quotes. It does the same quote over and over and over again. I'm like, this revealed Donkey Kong Country 3 is coming to. Really? Oh man, any, any other ones? Any of the other ones and stuff on the Switch Online? Oh man. Or NES and Super coming in. Oh wait, which ones? Now that we find out that Mario and we're in league with each other and. Oh gosh. Yeah, see? That one would be a random quote. Exactly. Yeah, that one is still random. I just want to kind of do it, like, automatically, because there's some really great, great, uh, quotes. Where I believe it was European exclusive. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Oh no! Ragnar says vanilla dome. Anybody else want to guess? How far we'll get by the end of stream? Or at least let's just say the three hour mark. Because obviously if we went later, we'd obviously be able to get further. Yes, is Nightshade. Tough enough. Factor. Okay. Thank you there, Demon. Yeah, the only one I know on that list is that... Uh, I still don't even think I played it, though. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, the other ones I don't, uh, don't recognize. Nightshade or Super Ballas. Yeah, I haven't either. Factor. Oh, it's a firefighting game. Huh. Sounds cool. Beard's starting to itch. Luxar Road and Top Secret Area. What not? Stand by my guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, I'm I'm gonna do that. My my I guess my equivalent of hundred percent. Playing every every state old. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, just it just to me and stuff like that it seems kind of cheap when you skip all that. There's some really fun levels and some good challenge levels too on this game. That's why even with like warping and stuff like that in Mario Three and stuff, it just seemed like cheap. I mean, when when I was a kid and stuff like that, you're just like, oh, watch this, I'm gonna beat this game really quick. You know, which is a kid and stuff like that felt pretty quick when you can go from like world one and two all the way to level eight and then like beat the game like literally i knew like that world eight pretty pretty well i knew world eight and stuff a lot better than i knew six and seven even five was a challenge what a great game i know right there jonathan again and how are you doing there buddy how are you doing there my friend Mario games are for kids until they get the Star Road and the Special Road. <laughs> I know, right? I know, it's like, oh, this is so easy.
They still are. What? They still are for kids? Are they... Be back, gotta lurk. Alright there, G-Man. Have a great lurk there, buddy. Apparently optional areas. We all beat when we were children. Yeah, it's for kids. <laughs> Mario... Oh, Mario's for kids? It's so easy. It's too... <laughs> It's two peelers. <laughs> oh my gosh, I know, right? Well, I mean, us is kids and stuff like that on being able to beat it. Yeah. The kids nowadays and stuff like that would be like, oh, this is tough. I'm going to beat these both, both ways anyway. Bad history at the level. Oh, do you? Oh my gosh, you know what? I forgot about Tubular. You know what? That was probably another suppressed memory to me and stuff there, Jazz of War. Watch, I'll probably get to Tubular and I'll feel the same way. I bet that's what it's going to be. Le World 7 was a suppressed memory of mine. Because for some reason, I didn't think level S World 7 was bad. Then again, I was drinking, so <laughs> that really did not help. Um, we had, like, what was it? A total of 67 deaths total in that playthrough. Which was probably the highest death total I've ever probably had on Super Mario 3. Uh, it was pretty ugly. We'll just have to figure out what we're going to play after this one. And if we just fly through these levels, play together, we'll probably have less than 10. Yeah, I mean, I would... You know what? If I... Playing these Mario games sober, it's not really that bad. Playing them while drinking? Yeah. They're, uh, pretty, uh, pretty bad. I could do this one and keep Yoshi. I'm trying to keep Yoshi right now. Roll two. Fritz with the host! Thank you so much for that host there, Fritz. Oh, you mean Super Mario World 2? After this lost levels, oh my gosh, jeez. And Bubba with the sub! Merry holidays, everyone. Thank you so much for that uh, sub. Reese of 23 months there, Aunt Bubba. Oh my gosh, that means that we'll do a free giveaway. And 500 points right now. Thank you so much. Yeah, Kevin, so, you know, I haven't played Super Mario World 2. So, it wouldn't, uh, it wouldn't be a blind playthrough for me. We're kind of, or, or, I mean, it would be a blind playthrough for me. It wouldn't be uh, uh, one that we played before. So, I'd like to probably save that for a different time. So, yeah, I never played it. <laughs> so, I can say, yeah. All, all of the above, right there, Jazzavar? All of the above. Or, well, let's see, uh, Super Mario 6. Oh my gosh, Super Mario 6. I haven't played a full playthrough on that one in a while. I don't know. I think I might, um, I might just stick to, um, probably, um, Dude, come on. No! Oh! Oh, wow. <sighs> all, of, all of it just trying to get Yoshi. I should have probably just been like, screw Alright, first death. Capitalist awareness. Damn, oh my gosh. No birth miss. Uh, Island uh, isn't very good. Japan, they uh, certainly didn't title it as a Mario game. Big stupid Americans into, into buying it. Oh my gosh. Thank you there, Ragnar. Thank you there, buddy. Up right there. Hey, Yoshi. Oh well. Just gonna try to unlock this and stuff to eat. So, um. Well, we didn't get the drool. Dragon. Code. Actually, enjoyed Super Mario World too. Cute and challenging. Had some great levels. Yeah, I never played it. 
I have it and stuff too. I think actually it was on one of our uh, polls and stuff too. Think? Think it might be? Hmm. Although naval Rana without the secret trick can die in a fiery pit. Oh gosh. Okay, cool. We got both uh, both on that. But, uh, thank you again and stuff there, uh, Aunt Bubba and stuff for that uh, resub. How are you doing and stuff there, uh, there AB? I love it how everybody calls her AB. I think I think it was uh, wasn't it Rug that started that? Called her AB. We got Rug, we got AB. So we're gonna go back into that one pipe. Actually, we don't even have to go through the, like the main regular part on this level, unless we were gonna get that track. Maybe they <laughs> don't like it. Gotta say the whole thing. You say, hey, name slick back. Oh my gosh, prefer calling her Ant 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 Man, Ant Man, Ant Man. Why Ant Man? streamer i was curious do you have to be licensed to stream it because i want to stream no 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 not uh, not at all it's up there double zero and double zero 76 thank you so much for that uh, follow welcome to the crew how are you doing great to see you i it god no just stream it, just stream it. I know, could you imagine if you had to probably license- I mean, you know what, I mean, who knows, maybe eventually it might get to that point, right? Oh my gosh, could you imagine if you just got a license, like, everything? Here, you're gonna have to pay us and stuff like that, you know, to do this, that, everything. Like, oh my gosh. If that was the case and stuff like- I mean, if you had to pay to be able to, to stream, you know, I, I don't know if many people and stuff would do that. I mean, that would just take even more, um, you know, away from the capability of streaming. <laughs> the Boondock cartoon episode is just far too much of my favorite. The stream guarantee will be not many streamers. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Quincy Jones, who <laughs> just can't help you. Sorry, kids. Never license. Want to go that route? Yeah, I know. You know, it's just everybody's like. It's like getting getting to that point and stuff too but yeah 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 i haven't heard anything on that boondock saints cartoon it didn't but that would be awesome yeah but uh, how are you doing there double zero i like that name double zero 76 oh man great episode <laughs> being irresponsible oh gosh have a good lurk and stuff there recon have a great lurk there my friend Quincy Jones. <laughs> oh, he and I go way back. Doing good. Awesome, awesome to hear. I, I'm always curious and everything else, too, on how... Um, how you found the uh, found you found the channel well too. Hmm. 
just curious and stuff if, uh... Channel like I did. I'm looking for a game you like and find the most entertaining and visual playing that game. Aw, thank you there, Jazzavar. Yeah. Were well, you kid back in the day and stuff? That's why. That's why I did with the beer hat. Up too. I'm like, hey, how can I set myself apart and be? Um, where? What? What would I? It was funny because I was like, what would I look for? What? What would get my attention immediately if I was gonna stream? Again, if I was looking for a person playing one of my favorite games, and then I was looking to see who to tune in to, and I'm like, Beer Hat, there you go. Wanted to stream Super Mario World and so Oh, cool! Nice! Anyone else was? Oh, nice! Awesome! Yeah, absolutely. It shouldn't be a problem. Like anyone showing footage of their games, percentage on YouTube, eventually stop because of the bad press so yeah i mean really and stuff like that if you think about it like people would 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 find the game and stuff would be, my my way of thinking is you know people would find the game see it streamed and then could possibly buy it but you know it's um that's the way i would look at it and stuff too streaming resident evil 2 at the time barely talked barely reacted and had uh have <laughs> a dead cat on this side of the oh my gosh the dead cat on this side of the road. Nothing wrong with- I know, right? Exactly! That's kind of like how I feel and stuff with the whole sound effects. Personally, you know? Made a game, I would hope that the fans of the game would show it to the, that. I know, you can, I mean, here's somebody and stuff like that, that you don't even have to pay. You get free advertising and stuff for them to play your game. I would just be happy on that. And, you know, one of those people that are watching that game could possibly be like, you know what, this is a really cool game. I really enjoy this. I'm going to go and buy it. I mean, how many people, it's, it's like... You know, people like thinking back in the day and stuff like that. Oh my gosh, if people stream it and stuff, nobody's going to buy the game. No! It's like almost the opposite. You know, I mean, yeah, you might get that one, absolutely one person maybe and stuff that are like, Oh, I watched the whole game, now I don't need to go and play it. But, you know, I mean, if you're going to be um, somebody that likes playing, you know, these games, you know, if you're, you're going to buy it, you know? So, anyway, that's my, uh, my... But, uh, yeah, absolutely, and stuff. Definitely, definitely stream at their double zero seventy six. And you know what, my... Okay, so here's my two cents on streaming. And stuff here is play... Make sure that you are streaming a game that you absolutely love and are having fun with. Absolutely. And if you love Super Mario World, play it. Stream it. Definitely. You know, I mean, that is probably the best advice that I could tell, like, anybody and stuff like that that's looking at streaming a game. Play something you like. Never just go, I mean, this is this is my two cents now. This is my take on it. Don't play a game, you know, just, just to play a game. Just to be able to, like, get kind of the numbers and stuff, too. You know, oh, you know, it's such a really popular game. If you're not having fun, people can, I think, definitely tell that. That you're not having fun and stuff on the game. You have to really like it. Either that or you got to be really good at faking it. I think as well too. But I think that that's definitely the best piece of advice I could give anybody. Is have fun. Even if, you know, you're playing this awesome, fantastic game and there's nobody watching you. Just have fun playing it. Eventually somebody is going to find you. Obviously that's one of my favorite things and stuff. Is identifying streamers when I have time. And seeing somebody who's playing a game. You know, and, um, and, and just having fun with it, you know? It's really what it is. Yeah, Blockbuster back in the day for renting out their games. Yeah, I know, right there, uh, Ragna? I know. I remember that, too. Got our timing off right there. Well, we got most. Until he only works with certain games. Ones that are driven almost entirely on narrative. 
if a game uh, without a established story and more skill driven that doesn't work. The fun of the game is playing it. Yeah. The way out of touch even back then. Yeah. Yeah. So anyway, and so yeah, definitely, absolutely they're double zero. Definitely. Go go for it. Definitely. Yeah, make make sure make sure you're playing a game that you love. Definitely. Absolutely recommend that, but uh, it is it is awesome to uh, uh, to meet you and stuff too. Absolutely. Uh oh. Yeah. What? Uh, what? Uh, obviously, you like uh, Super Mario World. But uh, what what other games are your favorite games as well too? But uh, what are some of your other favorites? Favorite uh, styles? Obviously, you like uh, Super Mario World, so you like retro. Feeling of a game playing is overcoming a powerful enemy or a tough section. Oh, I'll somebody else do it and see how they did. Your joy comes from being able to do it on your own skill and merit. Always the easiest thing. Yeah, absolutely. I know it, right? It is. It is. And you can't get that same enjoyment out of it. It is playing it. Rich. Let's, uh, let's go to this go. Dark Souls is popular. Yeah. Play World of Warcraft, uh, PlayStation 1 games like Crash Bandicoot and so- Oh, cool! Nice! Okay, so, uh, so World of Warcraft and stuff, and then, uh, a lot of, uh, kind of platformers. Okay, cool. Nice. I, I definitely like platformers. I never got into WoW, but, um, you know, my, my favorite is, uh, retro RPGs mainly. I play a lot of retro RPGs and stuff on the channel, but... You know, I like platformers as well, too. I'm probably more of a Zelda fan than uh, than Mario, but Mario's way up there. I just appreciate and stuff Mario and everything else like that and stuff and uh, in the games. I like more of the earlier ones and uh, uh, more of the uh, the, the later uh, later ones. I just I guess I just haven't really gotten into. I am uh, an eight-year-old child. <laughs> Kick, for example, I'm the best thing in the world since sliced bread, which you are. <laughs> you have played some Zelda random. Oh my gosh, I would totally love to play some Zelda randoms too. So many games and so I am. I never have to like worry about a lack of content. I would have so much fun with Zelda Rand. Actually, I want to play the Master Quest, so. Or then. Get a link for you. Absolutely! I That would be so cool. It's just like, when when would we do it? You know, we just have so many other games and stuff to play, too. Gosh, Vanilla Dome. We're going to be at, like, Vanilla Dome and stuff like that within almost by the second hour. That's plenty. <laughs> and at the real reason why the freeze when Mario looks at him, <laughs> you can never lay eyes on. Be lovable, say, so just gave him to look attractive. Still know the inner and outer. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Mario's body. Oh, my gosh. That is so crazy. So crazy. I think it's the other blue right here. 
This one I unlock. Not very many people got that beam. I think it's a Extra lives. It seems like this game has so many extra lives. I really want to play the Spyro games. I actually haven't played any Spyro games before. Or Crash Bandicoot and stuff for that matter either. Jeez. Goomba, Goomba Stomper. But I, I think I shared this last stream of my first memory of seeing Super Mario World. It was in a retro shop, and it was actually on the Super Famicom. And um, it was uh, it was really cool. I was like, "What is that?" It was like all in Japanese, and everything, and it was just amazing. Amazing. I was like, "What is this?" Sixteen-bit graphics. Oh man, one hour into streaming, and we're already almost like uh, right to the. Uh, Right to the tail end of World 2 here. So. Yeah, I, I love actually all the music. Extra lives in this game are like overabundant.
There we go. Do Monday cap. It went by. It went by pretty quick. It went pretty quick and stuff today. Hundred points if you had hundred lives. Yeah, I mean we. Well, eh, eh, eh. Yeah, I mean we're already gonna be beating this game pretty quickly, I think, and stuff with uh, with uh, getting through it. I, I'm thinking the rate that we are going. My gosh. Jeez. I mean, I know you said Vanilla Dome, but I think we might even get uh, into uh, Forest of Illusion maybe at this rate. Thousand points? <laughs> Hundred thousand points? Gosh. Imagine. Thousand points. Completing a vanilla dome is a given. Maybe for us, so. Oh yeah, yeah. I, well, I, well, yeah. I'm, I'm thinking and stuff like that too. Yeah, that probably, you know, we might be able to get up to the forest of illusion. Which at that point in time, then I'm almost thinking well, we could, you know, depending on the challenge and everything else like that, we might you know, complete this and. Uh, Which then we're gonna have to figure out kind of what uh, what we'll be doing uh, next. I haven't really thought of it really, aside from some of them that we mentioned. I mean, heck, we can. Uh, what what does everybody think? I mean, I don't know. Super Mario sixty four. I mean, I am really good at Mario three here. Well, <laughs> when I'm not drinking, I'm very good at Mario three. But um, and in Super Mario World, Mario sixty four, I did. I played. You know, obviously and stuff growing up, but not anything like this game. Like when it, it, Super Mario 64 came out, I wasn't playing as, I wasn't gaming as much. You know, but um, on these, uh, on this game, but I was thinking, I don't know, like I'll throw out some games like Chippendale Rescue Rangers, maybe, um, you know, we could also do maybe, you know, Jaws, maybe Nightmare on Elm Street, maybe even Friday the 13th, maybe, um, I don't know. That pipe getting longer as you get closer. Seems like a big pin back in the day. I get across that pit like in higher so you can make that jump in. Look at that, you fell in. <laughs> get good scrub, oh my gosh. Mario 2? Oh my gosh. Super Metroid? Oh my gosh. Super Metroid might take a little while though. Sonic. Get that tranny. Sonic commence. Oh my gosh. Sonic Wonder. I don't know. It's just, I mean, really, like, okay, so we're, like, probably theoretically looking at, like, four more. If we beat this by next stream, you know, we're looking at a total of four streams, and we have to be completely done with whatever games as well, too. That's one reason why I'm kind of picking short one. The only reason why we're playing Super Mario World here is because we got through, like, Super Mario 3, like, so quick. Like, if we only had two streams and I had to beat Super Mario World here, I may have even skipped it. But knowing that I had, obviously, you know, two weeks of streams, I knew we would get through it then. Um, no, I just, I just don't want to change. Oh. Oh, we're doing the Star Road. Yeah. The Star Road. Yeah, I'm just going, going through these here. I want to start road in special save. All star version of Mario 2. Yeah, saves. Just I mean that's true too. So, I mean really it's this kind of I, I mean I don't want to call it filler time, but um you know, I mean really the big deal is gonna be Pokemon uh, yellow and stuff at the uh 
the beginning of uh, of next year. Right there, our first stream in uh, in January. Ah. So that's kind of what we're uh, what we're waiting waiting on. Super Mario Brothers Two should have a slightly different ending. We use most throughout the game. I mean, that would be cool. It would be cool. It is 48 lives. It just seems like lives are abundant in this game. So much. <laughs> I was just... You know what? I use, uh... Toadstool. It was my, my player of choice. I know it's, like, probably, like, super easy that way. Anyway, so yeah, probably just some, uh, some e even, I mean, games that we could play, you know, kind of on stream, but even ones that we could just attempt, even, too. It's not even that we would have to complete it. We, we could do, I think I said Super Mario Land. Did I say Super Mario Land? I mean, it's been about a year since we played through that one. Two. Chippendale Rescue Rangers, same thing. Morton Koopa Jr. of Castle Number Two is now just a memory. The next area is the Underground Vanilla Dome. What traps await Mario in this new world? What will become of Princess Toadstool? All right. Well, let's let's start working on the Star Road then. We've got, um, yes, DuckTales are the remaster. Remaster. Got that one up on, uh, I'd have to hook up the Wii U. I haven't hooked up the Wii U in a while. Say that it couldn't be. But I would, yeah, NES DuckTales. Yeah, it's been a while since we played NES DuckTales. Absolutely. Hey, right. always continue. Hey, uh. Oh. Another good choice, NES DuckTales. Yeah. DuckTales is good. DuckTales. Last time we played, though, was, um...
I mean, if we had an eight-hour stream, I'm sure that we could beat this game easily in eight hours. Probably uh, different. Yoshi's. thing is, can we get this one? I think we might need the, um, we might need all of the, um, which is, though, right? Do we get, okay, right, we can fly here, then. Kind of spicy Yoshi, I know, right? Whoa! <laughs> I didn't even forgot it was like right there. Oh my gosh! I look professional on that. Ow! <laughs> that worked out perfect. <laughs> bottle fed a uh, bottle of ghost pepper hot sauce. Oh my gosh! Thank you, there, Ragna. Yeah, that was uh, obviously not. Uh, Completed it the uh, the regular way up there, so we completed the star. All right, sweet. Okay, Vanilla Dome it is. And then once we get all those switches, then we'll complete it. You know how much fun it is to play through a uh, a game that I'm just so familiar with and stuff on. Just it is a lot of fun. Kept flying. Th I know, right there, D-Man. I, I, I swear we'd probably be able to beat this game a lot quicker than we did on doing a, 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 a complete playthrough. Um, oh, Super Mario Brothers Three, like this. A piece of cake. So familiar with this. We played. Super Mario 64 would be a different story. Just, I played this a ton growing up. This and uh, Super Mario. Not me. 
need to do that, though. How's it going, everyone? Hey, Han Solo! How's it going there, my friend? How are you doing there, buddy? Turtle shells turn into one ups. Uh oh. Oh my gosh, guys, we got a raid! Elegant syntax with a raid! Oh my gosh, thank you so much and stuff there, Elegant Syntax, for that fantastic raid. What were you streaming? How, how was your stream? Oh my gosh, I missed the heck out of you there, Elegant Syntax. How are you doing? And welcome to the stream, Anita Noel Green. How are you doing? And obviously, Ivy Kitty. Ivy Kitty and stuff is well known and stuff around uh, this channel and the community as well, too. But how are you doing there, Elegant Syntax? Uh, how was your stream? What were you playing? And thank you there, Ragna and stuff, for doing the Raider Command, too. I'm well. How are you? I am doing great and stuff there, Elegant. I am doing great. How have you been? How have you been? Oh my gosh, I was I was just thinking about you and stuff the other day. Remember, remember when we had that whole entire um, uh, oh my gosh, the argyle that we were always talking about because you were wearing the argyle and stuff on stream, and I was just like thinking about that and stuff, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I like argyle too. And we we're just kind of going back and forth and stuff on that. Oh my gosh, we just had some fun times. So playing Ickenfell, it's a door. Is it really? Oh my gosh, that is awesome. That is really cool. I need more. I, I know. I do, too. I definitely do, too. Definitely. But I uh, hope you are doing well as well. So great to uh, to see you as well. And glad uh, the, uh, the the stream went uh, well as well, too. Oh, my gosh. I know. I just would just even stream in just three times a week. Even, like, weekends and stuff, too. A lot of people, like, stream on weekends. So it's like I could, like support people then but it's always uh, always family time and stuff on my end so i kind of miss uh, m miss those uh, great opportunities and stuff there too so um and uh even our uh, during the week streams and stuff too you know it's just three times a week and stuff uh monday through friday and stuff there somewhere in between there so yeah bell is uh, if you took final fantasy tactics and married it was a what Really? Oh my gosh, that sounds amazing. That sounds really cool. That sounds really cool. But it is so great to see in stuff there, Elegant Syntax. It is so great to see you there, my friend. Oh my gosh. I was also thinking in stuff too about, um, you know, when we were at TwitchCon and stuff um, last year. It just seems like it was a generation ago, doesn't it? But, uh, you know, hanging out and stuff there in that uh, Irish pub and stuff as well too. Uh, you and... Uh, and uh, Ivy Kitty as well. So, oh my gosh, such a fun time. Such a fun time. And I kind of miss those times. I mean, heck, even just eating in a restaurant. Just uh, miss it, right? <laughs> All the things we uh, we took for granted. Oh, I start, it's just like, it, it's, it's crazy because I feel like, you know, like older people and stuff have bucket lists, right? I feel like us younger people and stuff like that are going to have almost like the equivalent of a, of a bucket list. But it's not going to be of places that we want to go to before we die, but like places we want to go to and stuff, you know, and do when, you know, the virus is over, right? Gosh. It's just, it's just crazy. So... Yeah, I have, like, so many just different restaurants I want to go to. And so when things open up, I... So many restaurant places I want to support that just, you know, it's just it's not the same. I mean, yeah, you can go and support them absolutely and stuff. And and I encourage anybody and stuff to do so. We have some, some local restaurants and stuff kind of around here that we do that same thing too for. 
but um you know it's just being able to just go and you know order you know food and drinks and just you know ring up a really good bill and stuff for them to support them oh, it's just kind of tough to do that even when you're doing takeout i mean especially when it's a place that sells you know some really good grog you know it's really easy to uh to, to ring up a, a bill and stuff like that you know eating in versus eating out is different there it's here it's uh not uh, very bad well that's good that is good it is just like it is it is crazy and stuff around here you almost don't even want to leave house well yeah open hoping for the best on everything you know but yeah i mean they're just yeah pretty much outside dining in, in california is uh not even uh a thing anymore, really. Even though you have a lot of places and stuff that are still continuing to uh, to do that and stuff, just so they could stay open, stay business. Too. So, hey, Candy Cane, how is it going? It's just it's a tough situation. Oh, definitely, definitely a tough call. So, but, uh, yeah, I think just at the end of the day, there's just going to be so many businesses that just aren't going to be able to make. Gotcha. Gotcha. But how are you doing and stuff uh, today there, Candy King? Ow. That star, actually. Well, we got one of each. Ow! Jeez. I am doing great. I am doing great. Oh, no, 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 no! Took all my power-ups. Get me out of that little. There we go. Right, bonus level, <laughs> fifty-four lives. Fifty-four lives. I, it's just lives are just abundant in this game. Turn around and here's like here's another extra life. Here's another extra life. Here's a bonus extra life here. About to finally get on and play some uh, some of the F game. <laughs> All right there, Ragnar. We'll see you when you come back, buddy. <laughs> Don't judge me. <laughs> it was funny. Somebody made some comment and stuff like that, too. You know, just with, you know, you, you're talking about the F game and then, um, you know, a couple other people and stuff, too, you know, playing it and everything else. It's like, oh, wow, Cap is really uh, embracing the F game, isn't he? And stuff like that. And I'm like, hey, I'm, I'm not. I will I will not play it. You were not going to see that and stuff being played on stream by me. There was way too many other great games and stuff to play. I would play a million other games before I play the F game. I'm not. I am. I am not desperate. I am not desperate. And then plus, I'd I'd, I'd have to be having fun anyway. I'd have to be having enough time and stuff anyway. If I ever did play that game, it'd be uh, to play along with the uh, camaraderie. You know? Not the game itself. <laughs> Playing F night, not uh, that bad. Not for everyone. Doesn't deserve. It's personally, I know, but you know, we. It's just, it's kind of like the running meme and stuff in the channel. I mean, you know, honestly and stuff. At the end of the day, teach their own, right? But um, it's, it's, it's not for me. I'm, I'm not into the first person players. But I will tell you though. I will say that. Um, to me, it does feel like the Battle Royale for, like, retro games, like what they did with Super Mario Brothers 35, I think they're onto something with that. So, I, I guess I, I wouldn't even knock just all, you know, Battle Royale games, so. It's bad with me. Oh, man. Good thing, Cap. Good thing. And BF Night Streamers, do you. Nice. Okay, yeah. Third person, yeah. 
me playing uh, pretty well together. Some Breath of the Wild and some uh, redeeming qualities. <laughs> that looks fun. Yeah. Yeah. You know, like like I said, everybody has their, their games. I just know I'm not good at those games. I mean, I played Star Wars Battlefront and stuff too, and it was crazy. I had I had a really good following of people. Arts and stuff on on Twitch when that first came out, you know, around that time. I mean, we had so many views on it, um, you know, but, um, you know, along came kind of the baggage with the game, too, because um, we had a lot of, uh, you know, people and stuff like that, younger people and stuff like that, that just love to come into the chat and talk crap. So it's like, yeah, I'd get like 10 followers, but then I'd be banning 10 followers followers too it's like what a headache i mean literally and stuff I, I i can't even tell you the last time i banned anybody well probably one of the follow bot things you know they they happen to pop in every stream you know that's always fun but um you know like actually somebody being like obnoxious and rude and mean i i i think kids probably look at my stream and are like eh not worth it you know secret what, what other sync? Having fun is what matters. Yeah, exactly. Well, I was just saying that even earlier and stuff, too, you know, because somebody was asking about, you know, they wanted to know if you had to have a license to stream Super Mario World. I'm like, no, you don't have to. And and I, I gave my two cents as well, too. I'm like, you know what? And, and my two cents is play the games you love. If you are having fun with that game and you love that game, play it. You know? I mean, that that's all that matters. If you like playing... Fortnite. Go ahead and play it, definitely. Just be happy, though. Play a, a game that brings happiness to you. And you can portray that happiness. If you're going to stream something like that, do it. Definitely. Definitely. The game is fun and doing well. Give it credit. Look and play. Have fun, everyone. All right, have a good look there, Candy Cane. Your cap. It would be a nightmare due to all the toxic fans. I know. Well, it was Star Wars Battlefront. Same thing, too. People game, though. Prefer games with stories and some challenge. Yeah. Someone who shipped a uh, <laughs> team in Australia that was... <laughs> it might have been. And fighting games can be, get too repetitive for me. Yeah, I I, I think so too there, D-Man. Yeah. No. I, I like the story rich. I like just... The... I like a lot of those... Yeah, but the Battle Royale, like, they came up with Super Mario 35, I think that game has a lot of promise. Definitely. Ooh, that was close. how you can do this yeah you know what d-man loves playing that i have not played uh tetris uh, 99 and stuff there but i've heard so many great things about it i love super mario 35 though i really like that concept i really i really uh hope that they kind of build on that i mean could you imagine like a legend of zelda um battle royale one? Oh my gosh that'd be so much fun I love uh, Mario 35 Tetris for sure. Yeah, I gotta play Tetris at uh, 99. Yeah, stories, not great ones, but stories. Plays uh, blue, pretty complex stories. Hold them in high regard for gaming stories. Nice. Street Fighter and Mortal Kombat have okay stories. Yeah, probably the most original BR Royale I've seen made out of a 35 year old game. Yeah, I, it is, definitely. Another series that has a great story and long standing. Okay. Nice. Yeah. It'd just be really cool to see him build on it. I mean, there's just so much potential. They could do a Battle Royale out of a lot of different games. Kind of per um, you know, continue to uh, perfect it. Perfect some of these games. Well, look at this. Halfway through stream and we're almost done with Vanilla Dome. Among Us has a fun story. Oh, 
Call the ghost. Uh, great story. Not sure if we probably missed the other one, though, too. So many lives here. I'm thinking, depending on the, the challenge of some of the later um, levels, and I'm thinking another three-hour stream and we'll have this completed. I'll have to apologize to Jonathan again and stuff uh, as well, too. I just, I feel so bad. Some of these people are like, they miss the stream and they almost miss a whole game. You know, poor guy and stuff. He's like, wait, I thought you were playing Zelda 2. Why are you playing Zelda 3 already? Um... I already beat Zelda 2. Like, I'm good. Alright, I know. I, I always keep using you as, a, as an example there, buddy. But, uh, yeah, I know. I feel so bad. I'm like, oh, man. I just, I love these games. I love them, and I just go through them, and I, I know them so well. It's, it's one of those things where it's just like, I, I don't mean to, like, speed run through it. It's just, it, it feels like just supernatural to me going through it. So, we'd spin jump on those green bubbles. Yeah, that's true, too. I was actually thinking about that, too. I was thinking about that, too. That, too. Let's just try to jump jump them. Yeah, I just, I, I, I just feel like I, I just know these, uh, these games so well. The unfortunate thing is I wouldn't feel that same way with Mario uh, 64. But yeah, this one's my second, second favorite Mario game. Oh, by, you know, Super Mario 3 is my favorite one. I don't know, man, now I'm kind of feeling it. After playing both of, both of those games back to back, no, I don't want to say that Super Mario World is my favorite one, but... No, it's, I, I, I feel like we're just flying through this one. It, World, uh, World 6 and 7 kind of messed me up. World 7 especially. Like, oh my gosh, I must have had repressed memories on that. I didn't remember how bad that one was. It's been so long since I played through World 7. World 6, that one, that one area that we had to go through and... Like, no wonder why I always use that cloud. Just warp whistled those memories away. I think I probably did. Well, most of the time I did. I, I will I will tell you most of the time I did. Okay, it was it's it's been years years since I did I did a um a playthrough and stuff of um a full playthrough. Super Mario three. It was fun though. It was fun, but we were drinking too. But um, I, I think we probably would have still had like 20 to 30 deaths, probably. I, I What I really want to do, we recorded how many deaths? I think it was like, was it 64, 67? It was somewhere around there. I like reset the, the death counter and stuff uh, today. But anyways, just to uh, play through it again, maybe, you know, in a year or two and, and see if we could beat that record. That would be kind of cool. And just do the do the complete playthrough sober. 
And I'm sure with uh, if if we didn't drink, we could have probably beat it maybe even six hours. Well, I mean, technically we did beat it in six hours. Because we had the Nintendo Power Hour at first. But yeah, that was, I think, our longest stream done since, uh, since Green has been born. 67 deaths. Okay, thank you. I know that we recorded it in the Discord, too. But yeah, it was a lot. It was a lot, but it was fun. It was fun, and, and it gave me some challenge and stuff, too. It was, uh, it was a little bit of a handicap and stuff with having those drinks, too. But it was, it was fun. I just didn't remember those levels being so hard. I think next time we might have to do a silver playthrough of Super Mario 3 and a and a, a, a buzz playthrough of Super Mario World. <laughs> this rate. How many lives do we have? We're gonna get to 99. Uh, that's gonna be given. Great that we're going here. Oh. For the first time, it's through alongside Cap, and then I'll. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that would be so much fun. I would love to do a co-op playthrough. Huh? What'd you say? Yeah. Oh, wow. Or something. And there it went. But you play two players Super NES games online. You know well, you know what? I have I haven't tried it. They might. They might. I think. I think so. I haven't tried it though. I think I heard something about that, though. I haven't really played that many of the, uh, the Switch Online games and stuff here, the retro ones. Aside from the, uh, the more, uh, well-known kind of ones. On finding in Super Mario World that came up, the that Mario was... Oh, gosh. Fly like an eagle. Oh my gosh. Gosh. <laughs> and that's why we can't have that. Gives me a sober cap. <laughs> it will happen. I I have no clue. I... Oh, really? I really like this. <gasps> oh my gosh! Now I feel like that person on Super Mario Thirty Five that dies immediately. All right. Well, oh, whatever. You know what? We unlocked it. Let's go. Definitely. I that is like one of my least favorite cap.
I I will not be that uh, that cheapskate though that co comes in here and like just keeps coming here and getting all the uh, the one ups though. Get the Yoshi and then go back and then get the one up. Ah, like getting mine organically. Play Dark Souls. Good times. Yeah, oh my gosh. That's right. Really? I give myself a challenge here. That's all. Just, wow. Wow. My favorite stream, good times indeed. Just, wow. Just, wow. Thank you there, Ragnar. I, I like, I like that shortcut, though. That shortcut is super. Sunny D and Cheese Ball streams are done, though. Aww. We'll put the time in. Okay. Grab the wall of coins before you hit the. I could have, and I probably should have. Thank you. 
I just love the castle music. Thank you there. Yeah, well, we got all the way towards the uh, towards the end there. Pretty quick. We should get it this time. We can get that shortcut open again. I don't particularly. I that that uh, magic Koopa guy. I just probably one of my least favorite enemies. Like you know, like in every you know game, there's always that trolley character. I always feel that that's him. back, huh? <laughs> Knows the castle's still, still standing, want to talk about it. <laughs> oh my gosh. When the last time I actually played all of Super Mario World, it was probably on stream. Like what? Three years ago, maybe four years ago. He replies, and you want to talk about the savior who cheated on you? Oh gosh. says hello. Well, hello, Mrs. Jazzavar. Mrs. Jazzavar. Great to see ya. Okay, let's see if we can do this again. Come on! Oh my gosh! There we go. Gotcha. Finally! be on that pipe when he jumps up there. Right. Absolutely. I used... You know, we'll see. I know, right? Me too. Da -da 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 -da. Mario has triumphed over Lemmy Koopa of Castle number three. Mario's quest is starting to get much more difficult. 
You found the red and green switch yet? Absolutely. It's like a wacko, except that mole actually dies. Bean roast alive by lava when you win. Miss that Chuck E. Cheese? Oh my gosh, Chuck E. Cheese. I know, me too. This and Soda Lake. Ridiculous. is a terrible fight to go. Alright. Go to like you go up into the the top part of the
I'm gonna do the upper. Oh, I'll, I'm gonna do the upper bridge. I'm gonna do the upper bridge. I'm gonna do all the levels. I can do this one on the back. The upper bridge. I can unlock up the lake. Trail ray. Just a bit. I could hear you get coins before you even jump for them. Is it? Huh. Got it. least favorite Oh my gosh, that was hilarious. Without losing if though. Shortcut. Nine lives. Remember, we also have a free Steam giveaway and a spin of the wheel tonight, too. So, 20.
Yeah, I'm just gonna f*** all these. But Yoshi's still there. Ah, we didn't get all the dragon coins. Enough. Lives. Purpose to have a purpose. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so funny. Well, he definitely has a purpose. This part definitely has. Like Echo the Dolphin? Exactly. Echo the Dolphin. And four lives. that first the uh, the first like little mini castle that we cross it yeah, crazy but I think in every uh, level and stuff in Mario 3 for every world Uh, vanilla and chocolate, but no strawberry. Or... I know what the heck. Actually, flavors uh, three and four there. Definitely, I know. Gosh, strawberry. A bone to pick with you, dude. Got it. 
So bones at you, it's from the dead or friends that consumes and fits of like Oh my gosh. Anybody else's heart stopped there? The orphans and the European. I don't know. Chicken wings, right? I'm eating. In contest of buffalo wild wing. Gosh. It was close. That was definitely close. No, I, that's one thing you're gonna get with a cap stream. I'm gonna make a really somewhat okay game, but kind of tough. Now, whether or not that relates to gaming depends on when you. Oh my god! Ah, still. Bridge two. The goalposts unfollowed. <laughs> oh my gosh, Jazzabar, you wouldn't. You wouldn't. You wouldn't. You would miss me so much. You know it. Not over something like that. Now if I fix the new post, man. playing Zelda 2 all over again. Tim, <laughs> he's responsive for hundreds of thousands of his <laughs> suffer as, as he made them suffer. Oh my gosh.
<laughs> At 77 lives. Could afford to miss a couple full posts. Castle. The Tomb of Mario Victory Castle. Captain Retro! <laughs> Captain Retro. Hey, Cheezilla, how are you doing there, my friend? Awesome to see you there, buddy. How have you been? How have you been there, Cheezilla? Uh, great, by the way. Fitting it for the uh, the theme. Aw, thank you and stuff there, uh, Cheezilla. There. Yeah. It's... Here we go. Am I redeeming myself now, Jazzabar? Uh, with this? I missed a couple, uh, couple posts. Great. Life is pretty uh, darn decent. Nice. Awesome to hear. I always uh, enjoy seeing your uh, your Instagram posts there, too, Cheezilla. Oh, man. If it wasn't for... Um, if it wasn't for time zones, I'd be tired. about a one-up. I got 82 lives. second here. This is going to be at the, like, the last second. About... Fourteen seconds. It's exciting. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh jeez. Wow. Thank you there, uh, Jonathan again. Man. I was a little concerned, a little worried. A few tech issues, couldn't figure it out, so my IT for relevance looked at my specs and listed was retro cap device to recommend to me. One of you for a moment, then finished that. Came here for a chill to hold your live. Oh man, that is so awesome there, Cheezilla. That is awesome. Alright there, Ragnar, we'll see you when you come back. Castle number. Wasn't I right? I mean, we're gonna probably end, you know, stream probably in Force of Illusion unless we go a little bit. This, this, 
This is where things start. Uh, this area. Area and beyond. It's not my level 7, but it could be. I really missed uh, your, uh, the Dead Space uh, playthrough, sadly. Oh my gosh, Dead Space was so much fun. Oh my gosh, I would totally play that game in a heartbeat. Next um, next year, though, we're going to be doing Dead Sp a blind playthrough of Dead Space 2. I, I love playing Dead Space so much there. I was like, gosh, we're definitely doing the, the second one. Play it one day. Oh my gosh. It is. It was so much fun. It was. Yeah. I really, man, I was like, oh my gosh, I, I needed this in my life. Now that EA Play is uh, part of Game Pass, is certainty. Nice. 93 lives. Oh, we even got the 50. 96 lives. The game is ridiculous. The amount of lives you can get. Dragon Coin anymore. Fantastic job and stuff on the soundtrack. Oh, 
football player whistling. In the... I know, I was kind of thought of that same thing, too. <laughs> you don't want to know. Gosh. 97. <laughs> He's good at blowing. They watch it the fireworks underwater in SpongeBob. Gosh. Chuck is known for being able to anywhere on his body, anywhere. Oh. misbehaves out of discipline. Yeah. Thank you there, uh, there right now, MTG. Yeah, well, that happened, whoops. Exactly. Hey, Recon, back. Welcome back from the lurk there, buddy. Dropping the key beam. 
I was just thinking that too. That too. I was just absolute fuck. <laughs> oh, playing Cyberpunk? No. Story, buggy and uh, so yeah. You know what? Let's get the spin wheel here. We're just about at that time. Let's let's go ahead and spin. There we go. Now oh, it's time, and we have a free one. Seven hundred fifty points. Pricey. Pricey. Do that one, and then we'll do the free. One. So explanation. Point booty for a chance to win a uh, S. Oh, ow! Gosh. There is secret. Clerk, gonna make some food. Alright, there, Ragna. We will see you when you come back there. head out for the night. Awesome watching you as always. Hopefully I'll be able to catch you on Wednesday. Definitely catch you on Thursday. Take care, Captain and crew. All right there, Jazzavar. Have a great one there, buddy. Oh man, we got Floppy Kiwi here. How are you doing there, Floppy Kiwi? Awesome to see you there, my friend. So we just gotta make it regular way. Doing well, hanging out playing Spider Man. Nice. I wanna play that and stuff too. It looks really fun. Fully. How's it going there, buddy? Awesome to see you there, my friend. How are you doing today? Something coming in the mail, hopefully by uh, Thursday. Oh, cool. Nice. Awesome there, MTG. What is it? Playing some games, having a couple beers now. Nice. Can't go wrong with that. Sending you his PS4 camera? Really? Oh my god. So are we gonna, gonna have uh, camera streams now? Coming up? Some camera MTG streams? and beer are great. I know, right? Exactly. Alien isolations on... Gosh. 
the camera. I remember Versace was telling y'all about that. How to use the key. Really nice link. Oh my gosh. It is, it is a lot of fun. Isolation. Gosh. We almost, uh, almost played that game too. This, uh, this October time. September, October time. Played that game for days. Oh my gosh. Looking forward to it. It is, yeah, it's such a fun. Fully play that game again in a heartbeat. And we're max life. So we do have a giveaway going right now. 750 points against for a Steam key. Jonathan Again's jumping in. I wear this. On until dawn. Camera will uh, capture the jump scares. Oh my gosh. That's gonna be. That would be cool too. Gosh, until dawn was fun. these fire flowers and stuff are great in the fish that just fall asleep or like one of the trolliest enemies. Fight the fishing trip. This time instead of worms I'll use fireballs. Exactly. That's what I'm talking about. Sure there, cheese Stella. right here. There it is. Here's where it is. There it is. From the day Super Nintendo came out. It was the glory. I know, me too there, Smash Foley. Oh my gosh. My first memory of ever seeing um, a Super Nintendo, I remember, was in a retro store. And well, actually, it wasn't even Super Nintendo. It was a Super Famicom. The first time I saw Super Mario World was on that. And it was all in Japanese. And I was like, what is this? concerned about extra lives right now anyway. Most amazing game I'd ever seen. I know, right? Oh my gosh. Absolutely felt the same way there. Some that is the last switch, right? Yellow, green, red, and blue.
You get more than 90. Yeah, you can't. Yeah. Now we can get extra life. That's rough. Yeah. Done before. Thank you there, MTG. The 750 point is. Oh, D Man. Oh, no. Are we back to this again? All right, D Man. Number between 1 and 87. I do apologize. I made the list yet. Up there. So, your favorite numbers are on there. <laughs> okay, I think I think you picked one. All right, for two. Back again. Yeah. All right, for two. Congratulations, there, uh, D Man. You have won the game, Yumi Nikki. Yumi Nikki. So congratulations on that win, Yumi Nikki. You know what? Let's let's pick out one more uh, that group. I know the free one. Everybody will jump in on. You mean Nikki is a trip? Okay. All right. One more. That uh, that one is good game. If you like under. Oh, cool. Nice. Ooh, MTG. All right there, MTG. Number between 3 and 87. And G-Man, welcome back from the lurk there, buddy. 17. Okay, 17. Good. Beat the game. I know, right? Oh my gosh, almost. We're already in, in the force of illusion. Okay, so 17. Congratulations for MTG number 17. You have won the game Master Masquerade the Babbles of Doom. Masquerade the Babbles of Doom. This one is Humble Bundle or Humble Monthly one that we got. So, congratulations there, MTG. Let's open it up for the free one. Right. Boats are in uh, for a Dragon Warrior 2 replay. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. We're doing a Dragon Warrior 2 replay. Exactly. E Man requested it. Oh no. <laughs> He's like, oh, please, no. Not. Think. Oh. Yeah. Like those three lives weren't going to be helping us out too much. 
think there's two ways getting through this. What the? Really? If it's the uh, first one. This one's got two. Tempting me. I don't need that. Why are you trying to tempt me with that? That much. Comes back anyway. No. It's a trap, exactly. It is exactly. A trap. I love how you could, you know, jump into those. Think. Thank <laughs> you. 
think it's... Yeah, there we go. And I'm really gonna have to think about like what the next uh, game is gonna. Be. I am through this. I I I really honestly think with the amount of progress that we made this stream, I think by next stream we could complete it. We've got like this world. We've got the main main world, so the chocolate world. And. Um, Koopa's world. No shoes on. I know, you know what? I would love to do that, but that one's a that one would be a blind playthrough. And we're trying to kind of stay away from the playthroughs. Especially in a brand new game like that that I haven't played. That's my only concern. I just I want to make sure that we like have enough time to absolutely the, um, the games. I have never played Yoshi's, uh... You're, you're talking about this Super Mario World 2, right? Yeah, no, I've never played that one. I'd like to, though. Really would. You call yourself a cat, I know, right? Oh my gosh, I would love to, though. I really would. I think it's on, I think it could even be picked. I think it's on one of our lists, I think. I just haven't played the game since I've kind of been a while, too. I mean, it's probably a possibility, though. Okay. All right. All right, and for the free giveaway, our winner is... Ivy Kitty, nice. Alright, Ivy Kitty, I do have to tell you that the number, is, your favorite number is not available. So, number between 3 and 87. Good news is you won. The bad news is your number's not available. <laughs> Why do I that button? Trying to, uh, trying to hear people there. 87, dang, I know, right? 60. <laughs> right out the gate, exactly. 87, I think 87 is... Yeah. Alright, congratulations there, Ivy Kitty. Uh, number 87, you have won the game Eternal Journey New Atlantis. Eternal Journey New Atlantis. I have a reputation, I know, right? You can everybody picks that number too, usually now. That or 42. 42 is a popular one, too. 
But uh, congratulations there. I that in. You know what? I mean, I really kind of want to keep going. <laughs> the only thing is, is if we keep going, everything here too. Um, you know, we're not going to have very much of this game left for uh, for next time, really. So I think at least if we do this, so we have like pretty much the mate, the castle, and Force of Illusion. We have Chocolate Island. We have Bowser's area, the last area, and then we have like the special zone, and that's it. So even if we kind of get hung up and stuff, I think we absolutely have we could complete it in three hours, unless we really run into a huge snag. But um, you know, with the way that we're we're going on here, even in, and maybe even by Wednesday and stuff, I might even be willing to go into like a stream overtime possibly too. So we will have to uh, we'll have to. But um, yeah, I think that this is a good a good spot. I just you know I know that at times that uh, we've like gone from like one game into the next game as well too. But you know I usually hate doing having to do that, but we've done that a lot lately. So this is probably a good stopping because I think that with what we have up ahead here, that we'll be able to probably get it uh, done by uh, by next stream. I'm really thinking. I mean. I, I, just, I really didn't think that we were going to get as far as we did. And then it, uh, I'll have to start thinking and stuff over these next couple days on what we'll play next. We've got definitely several options. Games that could be played. Too. I mean, everything from like Sonic to maybe Chippendale Rescue Rangers to maybe Super Mario Land. Um, maybe Nightmare on Elm Street. I haven't done a, a full playthrough of Nightmare on Elm Street on the NES in a long time. It'd be, it'd be kind of cool to have some attempts on playing Friday the 13th, maybe. Even though that game is super, super tough to go through. That Jaws to be, be done and pretty quick. Yeah. We'll, we'll have to we'll have to kind of see um, I'd like to almost do like one that's kind of like a little bit of a longer game but then again we don't want to get hung up on that game like literally as soon as January comes along I want to start Pokemon yellow like immediately that first uh, that first stream back and stuff in January so that's that's one reason why we're kind of playing a lot of these uh, kind of one-off uh, kind of games here. So we're not going to probably start going through a lot of the other Mario games. But then again, too, I mean, we could maybe do a playthrough of Mar Super Mario Brothers 2. And maybe we'll do the All-Stars version. Or we could do Super Mario Brothers 1 as well. I mean, we're already kind of on the Mario kick. We already did the Zelda one. But uh, probably not, Yo not Yoshi's Island. I want to leave that and stuff like that for a blind playthrough that we can kind of go through and enjoy. I don't want to really have to feel like we have to rush through it. Even though we've been rushing through this this game, but I just I feel so comfortable playing this game. It's just it's really a lot of fun. I really like playing through Super Mario uh, Mario World. Like I said, one of my favorite uh, Mario games. Maybe Pokemon Yellow is gonna probably take a long. Oh, I know, I know. It's it it will it will. That's one reason why I kind of want to want to start playing it and stuff there in January, even if it takes us all the way through the month of January. No running shoes in that gen, I know, right? Yeah, yeah. But you know what? It'll it'll be fun. I don't know. It, 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 that's one reason why I kind of like doing some of these shorter ones. Like at least we can accomplish a lot of games, and it's a lot of fun. And then you know, then we'll be getting back into some of those longer RPGs and. Pokemon Yellow is going to definitely be that same uh, same style of one too. Definitely. Um, let's see. Is M MTG you still there, buddy? Right? Do you have any um, any uh, any um, ideas stuff on there? I mean, gosh, well. You know what, maybe, you know what, MTG, maybe I'll, t I'll take you up and stuff like that. Maybe maybe Wednesday or Thursday we'll kind of take a look at targets. You can. I have kind of a buddy and stuff on here right now that uh, normally I don't have a chance to uh, to raid them. Here too. 
And plus, I think a lot of the other people and stuff, at least that I'm seeing on my end here, people that we have, uh, we've created, at least one, one of them, I Yeah, that's good. I mean, we've still got two more streams to be able to go and support from, uh, from Digital Odyssey. You are welcome there, Jonathan, again. You are welcome. I was just, like, flying through these games. I feel I still feel so bad and stuff for Jonathan again. It's like, yep, and his Zelda too. He, like, flew right through that game. We flew right through that game. It was just so quick and stuff. And, and I didn't even do it on purpose. It's like, you know the game so well. You just run through it. Everyone have a great rest of your evening. You as well there, G-Man. You as well there, buddy. Remember, we'll be back and stuff, so... The rest of the streams that we have, no more Friday streams for the rest of the month and rest of the year. So we did all of our big giveaway streams um, here for the month. We'll, we'll, of course, obviously be picking them back up and stuff in, in January with our gift card giveaway. And then, of course, if we reach the retro sub goal and stuff in January, we'll be uh, we'll be getting back to doing those as well, too. So, But uh, we're going to be streaming um, Wednesday and Thursday this week, 5 p.m., uh, Pacific Standard Time, so that'll uh, those will be the stream. So Wednesday, Wednesday we should be able to complete this. I mean, I'm kind of excited to see if we do. We should, we should be able to. And I mean, I mean, two hours probably comfortably. But if we run into some snags, it might take the full full three hours. But um, on there and stuff, especially with like I know some of the special stages, they can be a bit tough. You know, kind of like that tubular that uh, Jazzavar was talking about. So, definitely. So, may hit up another Trader Joe's total wine run between now and next. Oh my gosh, there, D-Man. You'll have to, you have to show me what, uh, what you grab as well, too. Oh my gosh. We came early for D-Man. <laughs> I enjoyed your stream. Thank you for inspiring me to stream Super Mario World and not get... Yeah, absolutely, there, Double Zero. And please, uh, by all means and stuff, if you're able to come and hang out with us, I'm, um... In Southern California and stuff too, so Pacific Standard Time, usually our, our stream schedule is, I usually stream three times a week, and we usually stream from five to eight, Monday through Thursdays, and then Fridays we usually go a lot later, you know, five until 10, but, you know, this last last Friday we went until like 1, 1.30 a.m., so um, if you're able to tune in and stuff too, we play a lot of retro games, like I said, we got we got some some one-off kind of retro games we have coming up and then Pokemon Yellow coming up at the beginning of January, if you're able to tune in and stuff. But I'm, I'm, I'm glad that we were able to inspire you to uh, go through and, uh, and stream too. SR Gaming 3608 and Patrick. You know what? I know Patrick we, uh, we supported and stuff recently. The SR Gaming up there. And have a great night and stuff there, Weasel Almighty. Always, always great seeing you and stuff there, Weasel. Yeah, I, you know, I, I have a raid target and stuff already there in mind, and it's, it's somebody I usually don't see online at this point in time. So I'm kind of, and, and I know that if we go and raid this person, we would, uh, we would absolutely make this person's evening as well too. So I mean, I just always love being able to, you know, just make somebody's day up there too. You know, so I'm kind of excited about raiding this person. Plus, they're not usually on at this point in time. Some of these other people we've seen recently. So, but Wednesday, Thursday, definitely. I'll, I'll need your help there, MTG. I definitely want to uh, support someone from Digital Odyssey one of those nights, or maybe even both, depending on. So that's kind of at least the good thing with, at least on like Monday and stuff like that, you kind of feel like you have some some options when you're like first stream of the week. Like, you're like okay, we still have two more streams that we could kind of go and support someone. And stuff from the team so i think that that'll uh, that'll be good as well too but uh, super exciting so anyway so our raid target for tonight is uh you've seen him in the stream and stuff here quite a few times as well too and um it's uh, my good friend pokex as well too he's he's from norway so normally and stuff like that is not even on at this point in time and stuff on streaming, which is one one reason I'm kind of excited about uh, being able to rain it. I mean, usually he's on a lot earlier in the day. So I think that just taking this opportunity is super cool. But um, anyway, everyone, thank you so much for tuning in. Like I said, Super Mario World, one of my favorite retro Mario games. And just a ton of fun. We blew through this game. We almost got through Forest of Illusion. Like literally, if we stream, we could we could have completely completed this game in a Friday Friday night stream. Easy, easy, um, and we might even have been able to beat this game quicker than we did Super Mario Three. Believe believe it or not, 
I think, and stuff too. Then again, with Super Mario Bros. 3, we probably could have done better if I wasn't drinking, probably either too. But you know what? We completed it in the stream. It was fun. It was some challenge too. So have a great night and stuff there, Recon. So awesome to see you there, my friend. And everybody else, thank you so much for tuning in. Happy, again, happy Tuesday Eve. I will be back here on Hump Day. Hump Day, or like I also like to call it and stuff, thir uh, Thursday Eve as well too so thursday uh wednesday night thursday night 5 p.m pacific standard time will be the uh, the rest of the streams uh for the week and cheesezilla thank you so much and stuff for ha uh hanging out and stuff with us always so great to see you keep those posts and stuff going on um on instagram as well too i always always love being able to kind of drop in and stuff and see them as well too um as well so always always love all the posts and stuff but have a great night and stuff there recon and d-man everybody have a fantastic one and we'll you soon.